To understand the offer and compromise process, you first have to understand two concepts. The first is the reasonable collection potential, known as the RCP. The second one is the collection statute expiration date, um, CSED, also called the CSED, commonly called the CSED, okay? Um, the RCP, or the reasonable collection potential, is the amount of money that the IRS could expect to collect from you before the tax debt expires, notwithstanding any, any offers to compromise the liability. In other words, it's the amount of money that the IRS could expect to get from you if they just garnish your wages, right? If they just go ahead and garnish your wages and seize your bank accounts and take all the assets, it's the amount of money that they could expect to get from you before the tax liability becomes uh, uncollectible, before it expires. Now, the second concept, the C said, has to do with the amount of time that the IRS has to collect that debt before it expires, which is typically 10 years from the date that the tax was assessed, okay? So 10 years from the date that the tax, the tax was assessed, it will generally expire, and that date is known as the CSED date. 